It's become a military operation. German soldiers called in to help Berichtesgaden, where a state of emergency has been declared. The Bavarian town hasn't seen snow like this for years, and the dangers are all too real. We have many requests to help clear the roofs of buildings. In the town of Bad Reichenhall 13 years ago, 15 people died, many of them children, when a roof collapsed. It's important to keep a close eye on the roofs and secure any that pose a danger. Heavy snowfall has completely cut off the southern German town of Jachenau. It may look like a perfect picture postcard, but there are increasing concerns that food supplies are running low. In Switzerland, guests were lucky to survive an avalanche that came crashing through their hotel. Photos on social media show the devastation as the 300-metre avalanche swept into the building at the Schwarzgalb mountain pass, injuring three people. In the mountains around Innsbruck in Austria, they too are on avalanche standby. There are concerns that if the weather improves, people may take unnecessary risks. The fear is that people will say, well, there is a lot of snow, the weather is better. And our experience from the last 30 years has shown that the first day of improved weather is really dangerous. It's when most avalanche accidents happen. More than four meters of snow has already fallen in this region. For those living here, the hard work looked set to last some time yet. And DW's Amin Esif is covering the story for us from Autosee in Austria, which is struggling with extreme snowfall. Well, it snowed again last night, and I wouldn't be exaggerating if I said that this city, this town is completely buried. Uh, when you go through the streets, it gives the impression of walking through uh, a tunnel. I mean, the, the walls of snow are literally twice as tall as I am. Um, the, the headline this morning in the local newspaper was hope and trepidation. Uh, hope would probably describe this side of the, the village. Um, I'm in Alt Alsee, which has had some of the heaviest snowfall, but the villagers are really dealing with it. The bakery's open, the hotel's open, uh, people are walking through the streets. Um, there's uh, not snow plows, they don't have snow plows here, actually they have, um, they have uh, shovels, steam shovels going through the streets, literally carrying the snow because there's nowhere to put it, they have to put it in giant piles down the street. Now, trepidation would describe the other side of this village. Um, about a kilometer down the street, uh, they have been evacuated. It's completely closed off. No one's allowed to go there. And that's because of the danger of avalanches. Austrian authorities have issued the highest avalanche warning for that area. Um, even the mayor had to evacuate his house. Um, I don't know if you can hear it, but there's a helicopter flying overhead. And what those helicopters are doing are checking the situation to see if an avalanche is about to to go down and so people had to get out of that area.